That's a funny game. Mm -hmm. Strong bad. Army of two. Con Conquer's bad Con fur day. Yeah, Conquer's bad fur day. And Uncharted two. These, these wait, wait, just woo, 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 woo. first argument. Woo, woo. Oh. Jeffrey thinks Conquer's bad fur day is the funniest one. I think Uncharted 2 is the you've funniest never, one. That's because you've never played Conquer Bad Fur Day. I don't need to. Yes, you do. It's hilarious. Anyone who's played Conquer Bad Fur Day, if they put it in the comments, they'll explain to you why Conquer kicks yeah. your ass. Ten seconds. Why you think? Which one you think? Alright. What? So? Yeah, so it's an argument between those. Uh, these games were just like games, you know, that were ha ha kind of funny. I think I just reminded myself of Peter Rollis. So post your comments below to let us know which one of those you think should be the winner, and the one with the most on there says that should be the winner. Anyone who will be the one that wins. <laughs> Anyone who just understood the little faces and stuff I was making, you deserve a cookie. I will give you one. I will find you. I will go to your house and give you a cookie. Okay. I'm done now. Next one. Hang on. This is not how you hold a sword. <laughs> Imagine someone like trying to go kill someone like this. Yeah! Yeah! Yay! Okay. Next one is best free roaming game. Mm -hmm. Another argument. Yeah. Grand Theft Auto 4, mm. Earthbound, Brutal Legend, Infamous, and Prototype. I, I've i actually only played <laughs> Prototype, and it's actually really fun to run around. So, so. <laughs> argument. You really have to do that every time. Yeah. I mean, I if we were really in an argument, I mean, which one of us do you think would win? Anyway, I chose... Epic final battle. I ch oh, wait, I forgot. This is flat. Except for the point. It's got a point. So, I think Grand Theft Auto 4 is the best free roaming. And Jeffrey thinks Earthbound, Earthbound is. It's amazing. So you talk about Earthbound real quick. Have you ever seen anything on Earthbound? No. We should have put it in the funny game section because it's hilarious too. It's amazing. It's got a great gameplay, a great story. It's got bleh. If you played Super Smash Bros, any of them, it's got an S. Grand Theft Auto 4 has a great story. <laughs> Go three different maps. Are you flipping? Hey, really? Are you just flipping off the camera? No. Uh, no. <laughs> now you <No. laughs> I wouldn't do it. <laughs> Anyways, uh, yeah, three different maps you can go wait, to. Wait, Matt, I'm Kratos. Spoilers! 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 A yeah, very horrible spoiler. So yeah. Anyways, uh, it's funny, uh. <laughs> and you also have some pretty. No, don't. And you also have great cars. So. Yeah. Post your comments. You can teleport. Below. You can teleport in Earthbound. Oh, what? Post now? your comments below to tell us what you think should win. Grass I thought of four or Earthbound. I'll Next. come to your house and take that cookie back if you vote. Next is another <laughs> argument. <laughs> Between best adventure game. Mm. Zelda for N64. Both. Of Uncharted them. 2. Or Super Mario World. Jeffrey okay. says Zelda in 64. Yeah, these Why don't you talk about that? I say Uncharted 2. You know what Ocarina of Time is, and you love Ocarina of Time because you have had an N64. Basically, anyone with an N64 has had Ocarina of Time, and anyone who's had Ocarina of Time loves it. And it's amazing. You can go anywhere you want, and you can. Uh, sometimes you can slice anyone you want. It won't do anything, but eh, you can do it. Uncharted 2 has a great you story. Can, you can get a flock of chickens to chase after you. Uncharted 2 has a great story. It's funny. Has an online. 
has great graphics, got involved with the best game of 2009. Zelda's classic. Oh, can you get some chickens So in post there? your comments below which should win, Zelda, Ocarina of Time, or Uncharted 2. Alright, next. Uh, this is totally not awkward at all. Alright, next is uh, would be best two player game slash co op. Are you doing an award ceremony? Yeah. How did you, you guess the exact name of it? Alright, anyways. Uh, we Cam got a special cameo by Matthew's brother. He's right there. So we got there you go. Resident Evil 5. Wait, what? What is this? Best two player game co op. Oh, yeah, we we had to. We kind of had to agree on this because we kind of played all these yeah. together. Resident Evil 5, Army of Two, Call of Duty World at War, only for PS3 and Xbox 360 as a two player, and Dark Side uh, Chronicles. Technically, uh, on Wii, it's uh, Rail Shooter uh, World yeah. at War. And Dark Side Chronicles. Which is a rail shooter, and basically all rail shooters are or should be two player. So, me and Jeffrey both agreed that this game goes to Army of Two. Alright, Matt, uh, wait, these, these are the ones they, they gotta choose from on the best adventure game. What? Well, Super right. Mario World's good, but I don't think it's that good, Matthew. I mean, jeez. Alright, next... Mar He's a Mario fanboy, obviously. Next one is for best online game. We got Halo 2. Did we agree on this? Wait, hang on. <laughs> Another argument. Oh, yeah. Modern Warfare 2, Halo 2, World of Warcraft, and Uncharted 2. Jeffrey says, World of Warcraft. I say Modern Warfare 2. So let me talk about Modern Warfare 2. It has a great online. You can get to level 70. And then once you reach 70, you can choose to go prestige. Oh yeah, once you reach level 70, you can choose to take away all of your stuff. And for what? An extra emblem. So amazing. You get to level up, play with a bunch of your friends, and it's free. No, it's not. It's free to go online. The game's not free. So? How much did it cost? $60. Hmm. At least you don't have to pay a monthly fee of $15. You get four months for that. And that's about all I would stay addicted on. So you can't really put price on someone who's not completely like... So just talk, about, to... just talk about World of Warcraft. Well, the last for, the last two things before for, before price that you said, what were those? Uh, level up, play with your friends. Uh, you can do the exact same things on World of Warcraft. World of Warcraft, you have to pay fifteen dollars a month. Okay, which is don't stupid. bring in price, because people who can. <laughs> Have you ever seen a homeless guy playing World uh, Modern Warfare? You ever seen a homeless guy play World of Warcraft? That's my point. Anyways, post your comments below if Modern Warfare no. Two 